Finally, we might be getting sports series about girls that is actually about girls doing sports. Even again. Also has the bonus that the characters act like honest to goodness real teenage girls. There's a tendency to write teen girls as universally catty or solely obsessed with one or two generic things. These girls feel like the kind of people I went to school with, they have obsessions, annoyances, and the tendency to change their minds whenever they darn well please. Michi, the primary protagonist, talks a good game about being done with judo now that she's in high school, especially after her humiliation in her last competition in middle school. Still, it feels awfully like this is something that she has convinced herself she needs to do because she is now in high school. It's like taking the notion of the high school debut and turning it into something else, as if your middle school and high school interests cannot coexist within the same person. It's clear that she does enjoy judo, it just feels like somewhere along the way, she was convinced that it was something that she had to do because of her brother and that it perhaps wasn't delicate enough for one of society's fabled high school girls to be participating in. The judo itself is well done. I don't know a whole lot about the sport, but the sounds of it being practiced carry a sense of the power that has to be used to pull off many of the moves. Feet scrape against tatami mats, and bodies thump down without enough force to actually hurt, but with an actual weight to them that lets you know that someone's entire body weight has just landed. Even the accidental blow to Michi's face during the competition felt real. As she struggled to get back on her feet and resume the match, I was genuinely worried that her neck had been injured. We also get a good sense of the level of balance required, and when we see a shot of somebody's feet as they dig in for purchase on the tatami, it is apparent just how much they are grounding themselves. The physicality is very well done here, and the fact that the athletes in question are girls is not allowed to take away from showing them in unflattering positions or downplaying their strength. I don't love the character designs, they're squat and round. But that shouldn't be allowed to detract from the overall quality of the episode. The less aesthetically pleasing designs may even allow us to focus on the bodies rather than the faces and keep the girls from becoming too overtly sexualized. It's a strong start, even if the kendo girl annoys me unduly, and if you watch your sports shows for the actual sports, this is worth checking out. Thanks for watching this video. If you're a fan of anime, you'll definitely want to check out our channel for more great content. From reviews to discussions, we've got everything you need to feed your anime addiction. Make sure to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our latest updates. And don't forget to leave a comment below, we'd love to hear from you. Until next time, keep it anime.